Hi everybody. Today's video is about red glitter lipstick. Um, you may only do this once in a blue moon, but uh, when the time comes to do it, um, here's a tutorial to show you how to do it. So uh, please um, watch, subscribe if you haven't yet already, um, hit the thumbs up if you like the video as you're watching it, and um, I hope you like it. Um, here we go. All right, I've already um, moisturized my lips and exfoliated my lips, so I'm going in now with my um, Too Faced Lip Insurance just to give myself a good prime coat. Uh, good with something like this, with a full glitter makeup look, you, um, you're not going to be able to do much in the way of upkeep so it's really good to kind of lay everything down clean. Um, I'm then going down going in with my Urban Decay 24-7 slide on glide on lip pencil and ozone just to give myself a line underneath and on top just to um, really lock everything in. This is kind of a waxy pencil and um, I'm gonna bring you in a little bit actually okay now I'm going in with my Too Faced matte uh, melted matte liquid lipstick I would use a liquid matte lipstick um, I wouldn't use the um, ultra matte the ColourPop ones because those are a little bit drying and we're already going to be putting on a lot of kind of priming coats and things like that so we don't want to suck all the dryness out of our eyes out of our eyes out of our lips. So I'm going to go in and um, actually before I do this I am going to line. This is my ColourPop in Juju Rouge and line this. And it does feel tacky, which is what you would expect it to feel like because of the primer. All right, then I'm gonna go in with the uh, melted matte lipstick. And again, I would always use a melted, not a melted, but a, um, a liquid matte lipstick, but something that's not going to be sucking out all of the dryness. So I wouldn't use the ColourPop Ultra Matte for this, um, but Too Faced is good, the Sephora brand is good. Um, so I'm just gonna go in and color this. All right, and I'm gonna um, come back to you in about five minutes. I'm gonna let this dry down a little bit more. You can kind of see that it's still a little bit wet, but this will dry down to a matte, um, and that's kind of the, the idea of a, um, a matte liquid lipstick is that you put it on and it's kind of liquidy, but it dries down matte. So I'm gonna come back um, in about five minutes when this is dried down, and then we'll do the glitter. All right, so that's pretty much dried down. Now we're gonna go in with some um, glitter primer. I'm using the NYX glitter primer. Um, Too Faced also makes one, but this is really good and it's really, re really reasonable and you can get it at um, drugstores and at Ulta. So I'm gonna use my finger to apply this. Um, this is typically used for um, eyes, but I'm using it on my lips and I'm just putting it on my finger and I'm going to apply it. I'm going to wipe off the excess. Um, and this I also am going to let dry just a tiny bit, um, but not all the way because I do want it to be tacky when I put on the um, glitter. So I'm just going to fan myself and I'll speed you through this. Okay, that's pretty much the point that I want it to be at in terms of... Um, being tacky but also still being kind of dry. 
Then I'm going to go in. This is an eye brush. You can use a lip brush. Um, I just don't have one on hand. This is a Morphe uh, M443. I guess some people would use this for eyeliner or as a pencil brush, um, but I'm using it um, for this. And I'm using NYX Glitter Face and Body. A lot of these are not actually for your eyes. Um, so you do always want to be careful when you're using glitter um, on your eyes, but on your lips is fine. So I'm opening it up, being very careful. It does have a sifter on top, but um, I still don't want to spill it everywhere. And I'm going to dump some of this into the lid and I'm going to dip the brush in and even though my brush doesn't have any kind of emollient on it it's still sticking on it and this is what the brush looks like with the glitter on it oh and I'm just going to apply it to my lips kind of in patting motions Picking up some more. See that coming on? I'm just looking for areas where I need more coverage. Sorry, it's so quiet. Just getting so focused on the glitter. Um, it's kind of mesmerizing. That's pretty much it. Um, I'm gonna back you up and just talk about it a little bit. I'll be right back. And so this is the uh, finished look. Um, what I also would do is go in with a setting spray. This is the Milani uh, Make It Last setting spray, um, just on my lips. And then I'll fan this. Um, and what I also will do just to clean things up a little bit is come in with um this is my rimmel exaggerate um scandalize not exaggerate exaggerate is the lip uh just giving myself a little bit more of a line on the bottom just more definition totally optional and this is an eyeliner but i'm using it on my lips you wouldn't want to use a lip liner on your eyes but you can use an eyeliner on your lips yeah so um glitter lipstick I don't use this very often but um, good to have uh, good to have it in your arsenal if you need it let me know if you've uh, tried this please do try it actually uh, and let me know what your experience is like um, give the video a thumbs up uh, subscribe if you haven't yet already hit the bell button to get alerts whenever I am updating new content and I'll see you soon thanks bye